What you're about to see is about eight years of stuff acquisition, plus a few more. Good day, internet people. Lena here, and in this video, I'm welcoming you to the brand new studio. Over the past couple of weeks, I have worked pretty tirelessly to put together this space in which I can create, stream, and just do stuff. It's wonderful. I'm so pleased that it's turned out so nicely. And if you would like to hang out with me in this chilled new space, I'm live every Friday and Sunday evening, 6 p.m. UK time. Links in the description down below. For those new to the channel, it's going to seem like I've just spent all of the money to create just a room to faff about in. And that isn't entirely true. Uh, as I say, a lot of this has been acquired over many years um, and I have been streaming on Twitch for about, well, just over a year now. And so I thought it would be cool to take this room, which had been just a space in which boxes and stuff had just been gathering dust. It, it had just become like a, a dumping room, essentially. And I felt that there was so much more that could be done with it. So hopefully on screen right now, you'll start to see pictures of how it looks as I went through the immense tidying process. So this started on the 21st of September. Sadly, I didn't have any pictures of how the room looked before I started tidying, but hopefully even just seeing how it looks after the first day of tidying. Basically, it looked the same, only there's only there's less cardboard it, like less cardboard in it. What you'd notice as we go through the days, you start to see more of the floor, stuff starts to get organized, things start to get moved around. The biggest challenge of all, moving these uh, shelving units behind me, they took some doing especially as I was a bit lazy and didn't want to take most of the stuff off. So it was heavier than perhaps it should have been. That was on me. It was a good workout, if nothing else. But by the time of the 28th of September, we were close. And at that point, I decided to try and see if I could get myself a nice shiny new PC of my very own so that I wouldn't have to steal Jess's because I think she might be uh, a bit annoyed by that. So I put in the specs of the PC I wanted. I put in my application for finance and so thankfully I was accepted. And so then, because at that point I wasn't even, I've been doing all this tidying, but I was not even sure if I was going to be able to get a PC to kind of make this a stream room. But as I say, luckily enough, I was given the okay to go for finance. And so once the PC was ordered, it became a waiting game because at that point, Essentially, the room was almost completely finished and ready, re re just ready to have a ready to have a PC arrive to go in it. At this point, I do feel like it's only fair that I apologize to everyone in my Discord and also in my Twitch chat because uh, I've been going on about the thing. I, was, I, I just I just posted in the Discord. I've ordered a thing and just left it to interpretation as to what it is I might have done. No secrets anymore. It was the PC. So the PC itself, it's a Colink Void Black case. In it, we find a Ryzen 5 3600X coupled with a RTX 2060 Super, and that's joined by an Arus Elite B450 motherboard. Input goes by the Corsair K95 keyboard, very swishy gaming keyboard and uh, the uh, Corsair Iron Claw mouse. And of course, Stream Deck, Go XLR. Stream standard now, so had to have those. I mean, the, to be fair, I've had the Stream Deck and the Go XLR for a long time. It feels like a long time. I had the I had the Stream Deck. I've definitely had the Stream Deck for most of the time I've been streaming, so. And then I have two monitors. I've got uh, a 22 inch and a 27 inch. The 27 inch is the gaming screen. Uh, I'm so pleased that I'm gonna be able to play things like uh, Fortnite and Destiny. Destiny in particular, that's gonna be, that's so nice on uh, on, on 60 uh, FPS flat. It's, oh, it's so nice. I'm, I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be, I don't think I'll be able to run Fortnite on high ray tracing settings, but I think I might be able to get away with some like low settings. So that'd be cool. But I do know that even like the highest, you know, e even things like some of the 30 series ca uh, cards do struggle a little bit with some of the, uh, to maintain like high frame rates. I've, 
uh, I've seen some videos about it, but still. In any case, being able to play Fortnite and other such uh, other such games with nice and high smooth frame rates is going to be sweet. You know, my only downside is I've got to relearn all the buttons because I'm determined to be a keyboard person. Keyboard and mouse. Proper full PC master race on this one. So. That is going to be a fun thing to learn. This now also becomes, of course, not just a, stream a streaming space, but also a place in which I get to create videos. So more videos are going to be coming to the channel now. Huzzah. On top of that, I've now got dedicated space for music stuff. So I've got my guitar rack in here, my two amps, and I've got my MacBook, which I had just paid off because I've been I've been paying for that over the uh, on finance over the pre over the past couple of years. And the only uh, the main reason I was able to go for the PC was because I had paid off the MacBook. But I got the MacBook back in about 2017, and I got it specifically for recording music. I wanted to use GarageBand, great program, my EP, uh, Lay Your Ghosts, that was fully recorded um, and produced on that laptop. Um, link below if you want to check out the, the EP. But I'm currently in the process of working on um, a, um, a full album of my very own. Uh, as well as that, I'm working on a five song Beatles cover EP with a guy who I used to be in a, a, a function band many years ago. We've, we've remained great friends. And uh, yeah, so that's going to be fun too. I'm looking forward to getting stuck into that. But I can do all that in here and it doesn't annoy, uh, it doesn't annoy Jess because uh, we've, we've tried it out. Uh, I've played, I played my guitars reasonably loud in this room and uh, Jess can't hear it, which is great. So uh, I still have to be concerned about the neighbours, of course, because, you know, I live in a flat. I'm not like some neighbours that we've had. I've had to be careful. I've had to, you know, I try to be considerate. Wish, uh, I wish some of the neighbours we'd have had over the years were, but can't have everything, can we? Not only has tidying up this room to such an extent, as you saw from the pictures earlier, there was a lot of stuff that slowly disappeared from the room as the tidying process went on. In the end, I think about something like 10 or 11 bags full bin bags of trash and other you know and stuff we didn't need we were very you know we were pretty brutal with the stuff that was in this room it was a case of do we need it if not it's gone get rid of it um a lot of stuff went to recycling um but we've been able to now fill the shelves with lots of really cool old school stuff as you can see behind me, we have much retro goodness. You'll also see some Warhammer uh, here. <laughs> um, yes, there's some Warhammer there. There's there's a lot of it around. Um, there is a space just for just for Warhammer stuff, which is all Jess's. I don't have anywhere near as much. I do have, I, I do have some. I've got a, I've got my small little paints. A small little paint station here for if I want to just chill out and do a bit of painting. The little harlequins are here. The Ulysses and other ones elsewhere in the video as well. Um, but yeah, it is it is a wonderful space to be in. I'm so pleased with it. I'm very proud. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what I can do in this room uh, in terms of like being creative. As I say, making more videos, doing more, uh, doing more amazing streams oh I'm, I'm i'm so excited it's gonna be great another thing i've been able to do in this room as well to, to help streams out as well is that i've been able to bring back some of the uh other cameras to do multiple scenes which is fantastic so if i go like this hello we've got mid cam which is really nice wow i look really bright in that i need to turn the lights down <gasps> I haven't altered the uh, I haven't I haven't altered the colours on this one. But yeah, we've got mid cam, and we've got far cam. Hello, you can get a nice look at the room from here, and get an idea about the size of it, hiding up in the corner. Hello. So yeah, it's been really nice to be able to bring uh, bring back the uh, the multi cam stuff and incorporate it once again because i've got because that just just due to having the, the greater space to play with so i'm yeah super excited it's so great so that is the state of this room it has been completely transformed i now have a wonderful creative space to work with and it's going to be cool to see what we can do here i hope you'll uh, enjoy the ride with me 
Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video too. If you liked it, drop it a like, give us a subscribe and hit the old bell to get your notifications when the next videos come up. There are more on the way. In fact, the next video is going to be uh, what happened on the day the PC arrived and the fun of me unboxing everything and trying to get it all set up. So keep an eye out for that. I uh, hope also that you'll consider joining me over in my Twitch chat. Uh, again, I'm live every Friday and Sunday evenings at 6 p.m. UK time. Links for everything in the description down below. And uh, yeah, hopefully see you in my streams. And if not, see you soon. Jules died early again. I know, what's going on? Hello. Oh, God. Hello. Hello, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there right. may be one or two people there. Well, I tried to save you by taking out the entire team on my own.